Last month, Canada approved the use of the first ever vaccine to prevent cervical cancer. Now, there may be another method to fight the disease that on average kills one woman every day in this country. Scientists have stumbled on the medical properties of algae, a compound found both in the sea and in the kitchen. As CTV's medical specialist, Avis Favreau, reports, it's cheap, plentiful, and most importantly, seems to work. It's a common ingredient used to thicken everything, from milkshakes to baby food. And in one of those rare eureka moments, scientists in this lab discovered this inexpensive food additive may also be a most powerful weapon against the virus that causes genital warts and cervical cancer. This candidate is by far the best inhibitor that we found, a hundred times more potent than any other inhibitor we've been able to identify. It's called carrageenans, and it comes from this, red algae found off the coast of the Atlantic. Cheap and plentiful, it's surprisingly effective against HPV, the human papillomavirus. Something like a, a few drops of this stuff in a bathtub full of water, um, and it's still killing the virus at those, at those dilutions. So it's extremely potent. HPV infects cells in the genital tract. Researchers think that something in the carrageenan blocks the virus from sticking to the cells, preventing it from infecting them. So the goal now is to turn the food thickener into a gel, applied on the genitals before sexual contact. So far, this food additive's new viral killing powers have only been tested on HPV cells in the laboratory. So scientists have more work to do to confirm it works just as well in humans. And some think it may be a cheap addition or even an alternative to the newly approved vaccine against HPV. It also blocks the virus, but not all of the strains. And the vaccine will cost about $400 per patient versus a natural product that could cost just pennies. So there are going to be many, many women at risk of getting cervical cancer around the world who will not have access to this vaccine anytime soon. And so it may be that this being an inexpensive product these women could use. What's more, carrageenan is also being tested as a way of preventing herpes infection and perhaps even HIV. An intriguing example of where solutions to common diseases may be found in the most unexpected places. Avis Favreau, CTV News, Toronto.